In this video, I'm going to show you how to use Anki so that you can study the words and phrases that we learn in 5-Minute Italian. So this is a quick example of what Anki looks like. So here we've got this card with, with the word in English, the phrase in English, a table for two. Now you should think of how, how to say that in Italian. Can you remember the Italian word for, or the Italian phrase for a table for two? So here we think, hmm, okay, un tavolo per due, show answer, and we got that right. So here you have a few different options if you got it right, you can click good, um, or if you got it right very quickly you can click easy, and if, if you had some problems then you can click again. And Anki adjusts itself automatically to show you the ones that you get right easily less and the ones that you get wrong more often. So that saves you a lot of time and it can help you improve quicker with the words that you forget easily. So how can you start using Anki on your computer? So you can go to the website, it's apps.ankiweb.net. Um, you can also, if you type Anki into Google, it will be the first thing that comes up. Click on download, and then you can download it here. I'm not going to do that because I already have it downloaded on my computer. So, once you've got it downloaded, you can open Anki and you'll see this screen. You won't have the example deck because that's just what I've done for this video, but it should say default deck like this. Then, click on the file that we sent to you in the introduction email. It's imported the words automatically, the words and the phrases from the lesson. So we've got 5 Minutes Italian with 18 words, 5 Minutes Italian episode 24, these are the 18 words. So we've organised it in this way, uh, 5 Minutes Italian is like the, the, the mother deck, um, which like the umbrella deck where all of the different episodes will go into. So when we send you the file for episode 25, that will go under here as well in 26, so then you can revise the words all together. So let's click on here and let's start learning. So a table for two, can you remember? Let's ask ourselves, how do you say that in Italian? Un tavolo per due. Okay, that was pretty easy, so we can click easy. Uh, a table for three, un tavolo per tre. Easy. And then you can continue like this. I think Anki gives you about 20 words a day. And then when you come back to it the next day, you'll have a mixture of new words to study and old words to review as well. So that's it for the tutorial. If you have any questions or any problems getting this started, just let me know and I'll try and walk you through the steps. You can reply to the email that we sent you um, with the Anki tutorial in it.